my YouTube channel. It's me and Mariah if you guys are new. And thank you so much for subscribing. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe already. And don't forget to hit the bell notification because you do get notified when there's new uploads like this one. And it'll let you know, um, you know, like a text message when you, there's a new uploaded video. Anyways, today, as you see in the thumbnail, it's going to be another lipstick review. Uh, this one's a six, oh, six color set. And it's going to be right here. I got it from Amazon. I ordered it online. So that's a new thing for me. Um, this is a new product I never tried before. A cosmetic product, I'm saying. But other than that, we'll just take it out of the bag and we'll show you guys. Um, it's a Sugar Skull lipstick so which I thought was pretty cool because the thing that attracted me to it was the variety of colors um, was also the design of the products I never seen anybody design their lipstick like that before which was very unique and different for me so okay we're just gonna go ahead and open it up okay guys and this is the product it's called CMAADU it's a new product for me I looked all my research on how to pronounce the name of this cosmetic I don't know a clue, like seriously. And I'm gonna just turn it around so you guys can see this side. Like I said, it's like a sugar skull um, designed and it's very pretty and unique. I never seen a package like this before. And then also on this side, it has like the different six shades and like the different pictures that come with this product. But the all outside box looks the same for all of these. Um, other than that, like I said, the product is what really caught my eye with the sugar skull and the skeleton. So we're gonna take it out. They do have six shades. Like I said, that's what I ordered on Amazon. So they have the number at the bottom right here, if you guys can see. But yeah, so we're going to go ahead and take them out of the box now. I am going to not try on all six on my lips because that's just going to be a lot of rubbing off and like putting it back on. So I am going to just try one of these colors and then I'll just swatch them all on my wrist for you guys so you guys can see all the colors from there. Okay. This is lipstick number one of the Sugar Skulls. Like I said, they have a unique product, which I love, which is how the product looks and the design of it. As you can see, the skull, the gold accent around it, and then, you know, you see the color, which is very beautiful purple. And this one, like I said, the design is unique. It has a different unique. This one has another very lighter shade, more like a pinkish color. This one's a lighter, lighter shade of pink, which I never wrote this bright of a shade of pink, but full collection of the six set. Go to number six lipstick, and this one packaging, it kind of, these are the six swatches, guys, that I put on my wrist. And those are all the skeleton designs together in order and they're very beautiful and I just love the design of these lipsticks like I just bought them just because the design it was unique and it just caught my attention I thought that'd be kind of cool to bring out a lipstick and it has skeletons on it kind of cool anyways I'll show you guys the swatches on my arm now so you guys can see and I'll let you know the numbers of each gloss on my arm to the lipsticks that are in here okay guys so this is all the six swatches on my wrist like I said so this, this is swatch number one, which is the purple shade, which starts off on the line. Okay, number two, which is a little bit lighter, but more of like a reddish, I guess you could say a burgundy-ish kind of a color, which I like a lot. I think it's very pretty. As you see when I applied, you can tell when you're brushing it, you can see like brush strokes, which is kind of streaky, which is okay, but for these ones come out more better, you could tell, but these ones for me came out a lot more streaky. I don't know if it's because it was darker, but... It does appear like that. Okay, and this is swatch number three, which I said it was more like a Barbie-like for me, but you know what? I think I actually end up liking this color now that I see it more and it's dried. It's probably the next shade, which is shade number four, that's too bright for my complexion, I would think. Okay, okay, and this is swatch number four, which is, like I said, the Barbie pink, which I like. Swatch number five, and this is my favorite skeleton on the design of this lipstick. I just love the roses in her hair and just like how she has her long black hair. And last but not least, swatch number six, which I like too. It's kind of have like a nice feel. I never really tried those colors like grays and browns on me before, but you know, it's good to go out of your comfort zone. So I'll go ahead and give that one probably a try, but I think I'm more going to stick to try on for you guys is swatch number five because it's more like of a rose gold and I like rose gold okay okay guys as you've seen before I just showed you all the swatches it did say give five to ten minutes to uh five ten minutes wait that's a long time uh three to, three to five minutes to dry to let it dry and then we'll do the water test on it or actually I think it's pretty dry so we'll do that water test right now okay guys these are the six swatches one two three four five and six we're gonna go ahead and see it's waterproof because that's what they claim they claim that it's waterproof and non-stick proof, so we're going to turn on the water. Okay, so it seems not to be smearing, so they might be right. It's a waterproof product. I'm going to turn that off. 
Okay guys, so I did just put water on it. It's not smearing as much. I do see a little bit of offness on this one. Like see, it's kind of bleeding out a little bit, but let's get a bit of dry and see what's happening. Okay guys, as you see, we just left the bathroom to do the waterproof test. It did stay on, which was surprisingly. Like I said, I did order these on Amazon, but it is from an actual cosmetic pro um, cosmetic brand that they make their own things. They have different stuff on there. I am drying it to make sure, you know, that it doesn't come off. Um, as you guys can see, they did not come off nor smear um, when they dried on, dried. So we're just gonna apply product number five which is this rose gold kind of a color or light pink. I'll show you product number five, which is gonna be this one right here for you guys. Okay. I'm not gonna put lip liner on only because, I don't know, I just don't wanna put lip liner on, I'm just lazy. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, we're gonna get this number on and you guys let me know what you think. like I said okay this is shade number five like I said guys which I really love the color um, it has more of a soft look on me so it's more of a neutral a nude on me so I never had where it wore colors like that so it's new I kind of like it like I said it feels uh, it's weird it feels like nothing's on but it does feel like a little powdery like I guess like a powder feel on your lips for me um, the product does not smell bad and it's um, you know it's a good product. I like it. It said it was waterproof. It is. It didn't come off. The swatches are still on my arm. As you can see, they're um, not really smearing as much. They were waterproof as I applied it through the water. These two have more of a streaky look, like I said, and these ones came on more smoother on my wrist. So I do believe if you put that on your lips, it might give a streaky look, and you just got to be very careful as you apply them. Hey guys, let's go ahead and give it a kiss-proof test, because like you said, over time... I always have to kiss one of these paper to get off any access that might be on and then also that's how you tell if the product is really waterproof or non-stain proof, I guess. Okay. And there's just a little bit, as you see, like on the paper, a little bit on there, but that's nothing to worry about. So I say it's kiss proof and it's good product. It was only 14 bucks for six lipsticks that I got on Amazon. I'll leave a link down below in the description so you guys could also purchase that product if you're interested in buying it. I think it was worth it. It does have beautiful colors in it and it's worth a try. Also, um, if you guys go straight to their website and you just want to buy just one single lipstick instead of all six, they are only eight bucks only by the lipstick itself. Um, or you could get that on Amazon as well. They do sell other things on on their website, um, like other products like lipstick, eyeliner, concealer, powder, and etc. So you guys are more than welcome to check that out if you guys really love this brand and product and you guys um, want to see what else they make. They also make different kind of lipsticks as well, such as glitter ones. Um, so it's kiss proof and it, it does feel and it does feel and it smells great. Uh, so it's not a bad smell on your lips because nobody wants to smell something stinky around your upper lip and it's also waterproof so overall I think this is an amazing product I like the colors um, they're very new to me and they are a good amount of shades that's it for my video I thank you guys for all your guys support other than that I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day see you next time on my blog and Ryan's beauty bye